Hi all, welcome to the new episode of Tech Insert. Today we will look into this PIR motion sensor module. PIR is the short form of passive infrared. This module is using a chip named BIS0001. This chip is an inexpensive micro power PIR motion detector IC which will accept data from a sensor and will do some processing and give digital output according to the input. I am not doing any practical session today. This is because before doing practical things you need to know a bit more on this module. Lot of useful things are built inside this module. First is power supply. We will know about at what power supply this module is working on. Next we will study about sensitivity and time delay preset. Next we will study about where to give LDR and where to give thermistor in this module. And final one is types of triggers available in this module. Subscribe to my channel for getting new videos like this. Also press bell icon so you will never miss any videos from my channel. This is PIR sensor module and I will explain all about this module to you. In these three pins, first one is the ground or negative of the power supply and middle one is the digital out and the third pin is the plus VCC or positive supply. In this module we can give a power supply of plus 5 volt to 12 volt DC. But internally this module is working with 3.3 volt DC. This diode is used for polarity protection of the power supply. If you accidentally reverse the power supply then this diode will protect this module. From this diode the supply will reach this regulator. This, this is 3.3 volt regulator chip. Watch carefully you can see its number 7133-1 that is the chip number. This is the processing IC BISS0001. I will detach the front side front signal lens and will show you what is inside that. The front side plastic appearance dome is actually a Fresnel lens. This Fresnel lens will redirect all the infrared rays to the center of the sensor. Here they are in hexagonal shape. The sensor will identify the infrared rays and the depth of the infrared rays and will give it to the processing chip and this IC will process it and give digital 3.3 volt output. This preset is used for sensitivity adjustment. We can adjust it from 3 to 7 meters. The preset value is 1 mega ohm. This preset is used for adjusting delay time. That means when the sensor identifies a movement, the output will go to high state and how long it need to stay in the high state is determined by this preset. We can adjust it from 1 second to 3 minute. If more time is required, then we need to use a monostable multivibrator using triple five timer IC. The video link for monostable multivibrator is given in the description box. This is the selection for trigger type. This is actually a jumper connection and we can pull it and insert it into the pins. Here you can see that the top part is written as H which is multi trigger mode and bottom is written as L which is single trigger mode. Simply we can tell it as H mode and L mode. Single trigger mode means when the sensor identifies a motion it will trigger the output to the high state and will stay high in the predefined time period. In this time delay the sensor module will not monitor any motion. When the delay ends the output becomes low and if the motion continues then again triggers to the high state. Multi time period means in between this time period the sensor module will do multiple triggers as long as the motion exists in the target area. Now I will show you how to connect an LDR or a thermistor into this module. We can detach the DOM from the sensing module. Please like and share this video among your friends. You can see two non-soldering points RL and RT. RL is used for a resistor LDR and RT is used for resistor thermistor. If you are connecting the LDR then this module will only works in darkness. You can see the dome is made up of honeycomb shape and each hexagon is actually a fresnel lens which will redirect the IR way rays to, towards the center of the sensor. I believe this helps you to get fair knowledge about this PIR module. If you have any doubt please comment on this video. Please subscribe to my channel for getting more videos like this. That will be an encouragement to me for making more things like this to you. This is Tech Insert signing off. See you in another video. Till then goodbye and please take care.